Hello to all. This is our first chance uh, offering, uh, I guess, our preview uh, for the first chance sale there in Danville, Indiana, this coming Saturday, uh, the 28th. I guess uh, the day it would be at the Hendricks County Fairgrounds. Excited to uh, bring you bring you a group of pigs here with uh, Platt and Three's Company alongside some of our best buddies there and uh, a sale that uh, this will be the uh, third year, I believe, uh, but uh, it's been good. It's been good to say the least. I think uh, third or fourth year for the first chance, and I think uh, good pigs have sold, good pigs have won. Uh, it'll be the place to be, I guess, this Saturday if you want to look at some good ones from uh, different breeders throughout the country. Uh, we're really excited about the group we're bringing and uh, probably one of the more exciting groups that we brought out top to bottom uh, for a live sale setting. We're going to start off with the red ones we're bringing. We're bringing a barrow and a gilt. We're going to start off with this 98-5 gilt that Austin's got on the broom here. Uh, this 98-5 gilt is out of a, a, a tremendous litter. Uh, we've got a couple smaller gilts we're going to sell in our online sale. Uh, and then a, a pair of mate boars that we actually kept intact that we're going to feed and not offer. Uh, we're going to feed them for boars and see what they're going to do. So their pedigree reads, they're uh, actually November 20th born. Uh, pedigree is out of Statement Day, which is the world record selling Heimer boar. We bought it uh, at Louisville this year. And then the mother would be a Scuba Steve a Backdraft, which is actually a lackey gilt that Brantley showed last year successfully top five quite a few times in the spring. Uh, that uh, we got from Jason and Jackie there. Uh, their program, not many reds, but man, they're pretty good and uh, exciting to breeding, uh, exciting about this breeding. And then once we got the five pigs, uh, uh, we were jacked because we think uh, they're the right type and kind. This gilt's pretty special to us. I think gilt that uh, exemplifies look on the side profile, the big ring kind of look that maybe we've been known for to feed them for, but still the, the burliness and the stoutness and the forearm you love to have uh, to have some of those extras. Uh, I think this gilt is, is built for the jackpot ring. She's built for the uh, big ring and she's built to uh, be a tremendous kind of a sow so we're excited to offer her to the public there this coming Saturday. The Barrow is also a uh, statement day uh, statement day back uh, on a Thompson Brothers guilt it's uh, uh, this is 98-5 uh, excuse me this is 106-5 uh, Durock Barra, so his, uh, he's a statement day, and then uh, his uh, his mother is actually a neckbeard clout, so that mother would be the mother of Guy and Hendrickson's successful gilts uh, uh, that uh, showed all, all summer long that were successful throughout the jackpot and expo uh, that actually we sold at first chance last year, so uh, we think this bear is awfully good. Uh, probably fits the expo setting as good as anything and jackpot extremely well. He's heavy skeletoned. He's still got enough extension and look. He's square coming, good pastern set, and I think one that just balances up pretty darn good. Uh, he's going to be a fun one to feed and still offers the power and dimension we like to we like to see in him, but still uh, not going to have to wait on him to uh, get there because he's going to be there uh, hopefully his whole life. 